And beginning the news tonight, a requiem mass has been held for the late Sir Paul Victor Obing at the Flagstaff House in Accra. The service was attended by the President John Mahama, Chief of Staff Prosper Bani, Presidential Staffers and some Ministers of State. Parish priest of the Christ the King Church, Father Campbell, led the service at the Flagstaff House. President John Mahama, together with all senior presidential staffers and some ministers of state, were in attendance. The parish priest of the Christ the King Church, Reverend Father Campbell, recounted the contributions of Paul Victor Bing to national development, urging all to pray for his soul. The first fruits of all who have fallen asleep. Grant us through this mystery, your servant PV, who has gone before us, to his rest in Christ, that he may share in the joys of his resurrection. We ask you this to our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. The late PV Obin was the chairman of the National Development Planning Commission. And mercy. Well, meanwhile, some colleagues of Paul Victor Bain say his demise is a great loss to the country. Well, I think that uh, it came as a shock uh, to uh, many Ghanaians, and particularly uh, those of us who have had the privilege uh, to, to work with him. I think most Ghanaians are fully aware of the active role that he has played over the past several years and much more recently uh, even at the um, uh, National Economic Forum and therefore uh, for somebody who was full of uh, energy uh, working to serve his nation um, only for us to hear suddenly that he had passed on only um, about a few days ago uh, was a shock was a shock to many of us and we are still trying to come to grips with uh, with this uh, sudden loss Mr. P. V. Obing was a tireless public servant. He wanted to serve. He loved people, wanted the best for people. He was an astute politician and a unifier. It didn't matter which side you were coming from. You saw in this man a man of good wisdom, a lot of energy, a man of modesty who was willing to drive through to find solutions to problems. He was passionate. You could see he was passionate every time you saw him. He was engaging about whatever he cared about. So it's a shock for many of us. Some of us are in a state of disbelief and denial uh, because it was just last Thursday. President Mahama was paying tribute to several people he couldn't mention everyone, but when he looked, he saw PV, he paid tribute to the energy, the spirit of consensus and nationalism and patriotism that PV would always bring to the table. He was such a compassionate person. This came across in his whole life. He was compassionate, he was kind, he was caring, he was loving. This was PV. He had compassion for everybody, he had time for every, even the small children in the church. He had time for them, he'd call them Uncle PV, Uncle PV. He had time for everybody. He had that, he was a very human person, very, you know, loving person, kind and caring. This was PV and this is what I would always remember him for. Anytime you went to see him, he had that compassion in his heart and he had time for him, wanting to help as much as possible, especially the poor and the needy. He wanted to bridge that gap between the rich and the poor.